As we continue to look back in our WJAC archives, one thing continues to amaze us. News crews had extraordinary access to crime and accident scenes and even hospital emergency rooms. With that ability to be up close comes an element of danger. And as we've seen time and time again, WJAC's videographers put their own safety at risk, oftentimes alongside police and first responders, all to bring you the story. Our community, your stories, sponsored by Gallagher's and Pristos. This clip from March 1973 caught our attention. It starts with our film crew arriving at a Dilltown restaurant. A man had just walked in and shot and killed a woman. Within minutes, police know who they're looking for and head to his home. Police begin to converge on the location, believing their suspect is inside this mobile home. Our videographer is there among police and state troopers as they gear up with vests and gas masks. Then other journalists, along with our videographer, huddle against a police car looking for safety, shoulder to shoulder with law enforcement officers whose rifles are trained on the home on the hill. The camera keeps rolling as troopers begin to climb the hill looking for the gunman. They pause to check out a burning car in the front yard before moving to the home. Our camera maneuvers to watch other officers run up the hill and around the yard. Police return to the burning car and discover the gunman's body inside. They say he took his own life. Our viewers got to see the dangers of police work up close because of the dedication of our videographers. Thanks for watching the WJAC YouTube channel. For more archive footage from atop the Alleghenies, be sure to subscribe to this channel and click the bell to receive notifications.